Welcome to the site of Reversible Destiny Yoro. This fantastic site is part of the larger Yoro Park, famous for the Yoro Waterfall, located in Gifu Prefecture, Japan. Open to the public in 1995, the Yoro site continues to attract many tourists from all over Japan and abroad. I hope you will encounter many unexpected happenings through this virtual tour and that it helps you by shuffling and juggling your body together. The official entrance of the site is the Gate of Non-Dying. This gate is totally different from the gates that we usually imagine because you can pass through it or come and go freely again and again. After crossing the gate, you will see the Insect Mountain Range. There is a water well at the top of the mountain. Just like animals or insects that gather in search of water, you can climb up the mountain on all fours. I'm in the Reversible Destiny Office Yaro, which was completed in 1997. As you can see, the design and undulation on the floor and the ceiling perfectly mirror each other. Today, this building is very popular among not only for children who enjoy running through the maze-like floor, but also for social media users. It's exciting to see the playful images they have taken here which make it seem as if people had escaped from the laws of gravity. And that is exactly what Arakawa and Madeline Ginz were trying to let visitors experience. Critical Resemblance House is the main pavilion of the site of Reversible Destiny. It has a map of Gifu Prefecture as its roof and there are many entrances and exits. We encourage you to take your time here to prepare for your upcoming journey. Your experience at Critical Resemblance House will be key to fully enjoying the site. After the Critical Resemblance House, you will find Exactitude Ridge halfway up a steep hill. Then, you will reach the edge of the elliptical field. There are nine architecture fragments in the elliptical field, which are also called as pavilions. Each pavilion is a replica of a piece from the main pavilion in Yoro, the Critical Resemblance House. It's a bit difficult to figure out which pavilion is which part of the house. But perhaps this destiny house will be easiest to understand. This maze-like pavilion is a horizontal cross-section of the critical resemblance house. Throughout the elliptical field, there are five maps of Japan, each presented at a different scale, combined with fragments of maps of various cities around the world. For example, if you were walking on the New York City map five minutes ago, then now you may find yourself walking on the city map of Beijing or on a map of St. Petersburg. It is as if you could easily cross the borders and move seamlessly through time and space. Arakawa and Gins prepared a special map for visitors of Site of Reversible Destiny. In total, the site has 148 paths with unique names carefully laid out by the artist. Some names are visible, but most of the paths are to be found only on the map. In other words, reading the site's map is more like reading Arakawa and Gins' poetry. Facing the dramatic undulation of the elliptical field, you might be at a loss for words. 
If you mistakenly wore high-heeled shoes or flip-flops, it might be difficult to walk through some parts of the field without using your hands. If you don't know where to go, try following the children. They can guide you with the best directions on how to move here. Geographical Ghost and Cleaving Hall are two pitch-dark pavilions. Both structures have nondescript entrances, but try not to miss them. The total area of the site of Reversible Destiny is approximately 18,000 square meters. But in the artist's early drawings, we see that it was intended to be part of an even larger site. In the master plan for Yoro Cosmological Gardens, we can see that Arakawa and Gens were planning to construct various sites and structures, such as a reversible Disney apartment without ceiling roof upon a half gourd and half eggplant bridge, archaeological map of lived experience, a road that is a house, Martian village, nostalgia generator, twin botanical gardens, 52 tea house village, a house that is a road, reversible destiny hospice, and between the original Yoro Falls and replica of Yoro Falls, which is three meter height, there is talking road and thinking road. Through their project in Yoro Town, Arakawa and Gins envisioned constructing a sacred place that would take the regional characteristics of the town and transforming them into a new universal city for living bodies. Behind the site of Reversible Destiny Yoro, you can see the Yoro Mountains. For Arakawa and Madlingans, it was quite important to borrow the surrounding landscape to construct their own artificial landscape. If you'd like more tips to better enjoy your experience, there are also a set of directions for use provided by the artist. I hope you too will have the chance to come and experience the site of Reversible Destiny Yarrow in near future. Thank you very much.